Amy, me, Trevon, say hi Trevon. Hello. And a blank seat. <laughs> so Trevon with the drive-thru, he's like, are you ready? And I'm like, yeah, so this is what he ordered. Do you remember what it was? Let me see what it looks like. It looked really good. Here's a special drink I ordered for Trevon and he made me laugh, cause what is it? Do you even know Trevon? Yes, it's a Trenta Passion Tea. Mm -hmm. With half black tea and half passion tea. Okay. It's regular amount of lemonade. Regular amount of classic syrup. <laughs> Mm, with strawberry lime <laughs> and raspberry inclusion. 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 I had to actually say that. Inclusion. So I'm ordering all the stuff and I'm like, well, I bought I'm like, with strawberry lime and raspberry inclusion. And he's like, okay. But that, look at that. See it? Look at that. That looks really good. Just, it does. Yeah. It's 9.50 in the morning. And uh, yeah, we're headed to Tampa. So it's only going to be like an hour and 20 minutes. I'm excited. And, and it's nice only going to be three of us. We'll talk about that in a second. Oh, yeah. Port of Tampa. We're here already. Yeah. It's like not, we just got on the road. It's like an hour and 20 minutes, hour and a half from Orlando. Okay, nice. well I guess it's time to explain why there's only three of us in the car, huh? Yeah, so which way does this go? West total 618? I don't know, okay. is the, um, do we have the maps on this time? No, I'm just gonna follow the sign. We've never, I've been to the Port of Tampa years ago just to look, but I, we've never ever sailed out of Tampa before, so I'm really excited about it. Wait, this is the one that has like all that uh, industrial looking and stuff that we go out of. It has like some, like the aquarium is there and we had tea at this tea shop there, don't you remember? Did I ever go there or did you go with mom? I don't think I ever went to Tampa. You did. Remember we got the jasmine tea from this little store there and they had a dog park. I don't know, oh, oh, I remember it was right across from the ports. You're right, but I never actually went to the port, right? Like out of it, sailed out of it. None of us have. Oh, this is cool. It's like right downtown then. Port of Tampa, downtown. Cruise ships. Oh my gosh. That's a sign I like I to see. I don't want to see that. Cruise ships. <laughs> oh wait. Wait. Those are yachts. It has to be like okay, right I over there. Like, you saw I know. Ship. But I remember it was where we used to see them, like right there. Are you sure that's not it? It has to be. Yeah, that's a ship. Well, that's it. Is it? I think that's ours. Are you serious? Yeah, it looks so weird right there in those buildings. And we get to go under a bridge when we leave, you guys. Oh, that's sails cool. under the what's it called? The Skyway Bridge? A big beautiful bridge. Oh, that's really cool. That's another first too. Um, yeah, there you go, the Royal Caribbean. That is it. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. Oh my it's the only one there, that little ship. It's so little looking. It's not one of the big ones, but it's not one of the tiny ones either. Oh, oh what a look view. at it. There it is, Trevon. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's actually not as near as small as I thought it was gonna be. I saw it in Key West a couple months ago. That's so pretty. I'm so sad Minara's not here. Yeah, so it was supposed to be us, including Minara. We actually did pay for her ticket. Yeah, we don't like here, right? get a refund or anything. She just missed it because last week we went to apply for passports, me and her. And um, last night, I know we should have looked earlier. Well, no, she did all the information on the internet, looked it up, like, you know, what do you have to have for a passport, what you do, how long it takes, all that. Because they did a book a cruise in March. Yeah. And they're worried they need a passport for it. So she's like, well, we'll go, you know, like a week ago and get it so we'll have it in time for March, right? Because it takes like, what, four to six oh, weeks or something cruise terminals that to get way. the passport? So we went last week to get it and to have it in time for March so we wouldn't miss the cruise. Yeah. And. <laughs> and so last night we went to get the birth certificates out of the paperwork from that day and there were, they, wasn't, they weren't there. Mine or hers, but I have two, thank goodness. And turns out we looked everywhere, which we don't misplace things like no, that. No, we looked. I mean, we spent the half day I was supposed to be packing. We spent we, everything in the house, the car is like, I mean, we went through every single thing. You don't misplace things thing. like that. So we thought, I don't know what happened. But anyway, we couldn't find them. And then so this morning I called the post office and they opened. And I said, I think we left our birth certificates there last week. And they're like, oh, we have them. Or I was like, what? And he's like, yeah, we sent them in with your application. And they have to go with the application. I'm like, oh, no. I had no idea. They didn't tell us. And we didn't, we didn't know. know that they would take your birth certificate. So if you guys are getting a passport, they will take your birth certificate and you will not get it back for the four to six weeks if you do the regular processing. So time. make sure you don't need that birth certificate exactly. four to six weeks. If you're going on a cruise or somewhere within four to six weeks, don't do your passport until you get back. It's so sad. I Minara's mean, so excited. It's a Comic Con cruise. She had her cosplay outfit ready. We spent money on it. She spent like a whole her day ticket, putting it together. Everything. She was going to see her friend. She was going to meet like all these people. And it was just. So, so sad. I know there's nothing the cruise line can do because it's customs that has to have proof. If it's a minor, you have to have a birth certificate or ID. Same with an adult. If you don't yeah. have a passport, you have to have a birth certificate and ID if you're an adult. There's nothing the cruise line can do. They will not make any exceptions no matter no. times you've sailed with them because it's not a cruise line thing. If you're not in the same state or even county, maybe, you can't just go pick up a birth certificate. Right. She has North Carolina uh, birth. 
So that was really, really sad. She's so, so disappointed, sad. crying. So she's I was crying. To be here right now. I know. We miss you, Minara. Everyone will miss you. But I'm still excited to go on the cruise because we have Trevon too, you know. Look at the trolley. We oh, were on that. that. The streetcar. Look at that. Yes. So this is uh, Ybor City, Y B O R, and they have the Cuban cigar shops, and they have a really cool apple. Um, my window's dirty. What's it called? Apple cider brewery. The same handprint, like someone's trying to get out of your window. <laughs> and the ship is right over there, which you guys will see in a minute. But that's cool. They have the little trolley cars that go around. So there's a parking lot over there. I don't know if it's a cruise parking. The ship is right behind this Port Tampa Bay building. But look, it's like quiet, you know, because it's a small port. And uh, there's an aquarium up that way. The coffee shop we went to was over there. There's the ship and the aquarium. Oh, aquarium parking that way. That's been a long time since I've been on Royal Caribbean. How many months? I, I, I just went not too long ago, but it's been a while since you've been. That's nice. That's bigger than I thought it was. Look, here's a sign. It looks like a lot of different I things. I just saw a sign, so Convention Center, Terminal 2, and Aquarium. Cruise parking right there on the right. Three. Ah, right there. Cruise parking. There's also Terminals 2 and 3 up here. See, More there's cruise look, parking. Two, look at those big signs. Two oh, wow. cruise terminals. Do you know which one you're going out of? No. Port Tampa Bay parking garage right there. That's, oh, okay. It, it's just right across the street. Oh, right here? Yeah, Let's see? just do this one, yeah. So you park there and you walk across the street. So I'm just going to do right a little here, circle. Right We're still driving around looking for the parking. <laughs> well, is that the parking? Is this way? It did say it was this way. Maybe we missed it. Oh. Oh. And isn't the coffee right there? It is. Yeah, that's right, right there. The V. Victory, Victory Coffee. Victory Coffee and Tea Bar. Yeah, and they let your dog go in. That's a good place. It was. Oh, I can't wait to go up in the, what's that called? The, the round thing they have? Oh, come on. What's the round seating area called? Viking Lounge. Viking it's Lounge. right now. Look, you guys, Victory Coffee and Tea Bar. There's some advertisement. Now let's try to find the parking. How many times do you think we'll go around oh, to find it. it? I just don't know how to get in. There. Right here. <laughs> we took the scenic route. And it's $15 a day, by the way. Okay, that's not bad. Is that, isn't it 20 in Miami? Four day cruise parking, 60. Five day, 75. Seven day, 105. And each additional day, 15. Well, that's cheaper than Miami. Yeah. That's for real. Go ahead and go up the ramp and park anywhere you like on the third floor. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Third floor? Is that because this is the Brilliance? Is that what we're getting on? Oh, yeah. Look, there. I've never seen that oh. before. Level one closed, level two paradise, Carnival three paradise. Brilliance, four Osterdam. I want to go on a Holland America so bad. It says Osterdam. Level five Jade Osterdam. and level six closed. You guys know the damn ships, right? So you see that. Ships. It's like those damn, those damn ships. Those damn ships. So we started sailing on, and that's where I want to sail on so bad. And the Norwegian Jade. Too bad we don't see other ships up here yeah. right now. Up ramp, then left for third floor. So we're getting out of the car. I always have my tip money for the porter. I have my set sail pass. I have birth certificates, driver's license. We will have passports here soon. I really recommend everybody get a passport if you can. You're going to need it one of these days. And without it, you can't get back in the country anyway. There's a ship. I didn't really look into the ship too much. All I know is I've always wanted to go on it. And I really didn't know it was this big. It kind of reminds me of the Navigator. And we have a balcony. I just really remembered that. I'm excited on the eighth floor. And you guys, this is a special cruise. It's chartered, which means people couldn't just book the sailing today on January 19th. It was bought out for a special cruise because there's famous people on it from Stranger, what is that called? Stranger Things? Stranger Danger? Stranger Tide? No, what is it? Stranger Things? What's it called? The Walking Dead? You're the king. All kinds of famous people. It's a cosplay, Comic Con. It's called Fan 2C. F A N 2 S E A. Special cruise, chartered, private. It's so exciting. You guys, this also marks our first ever B2B2B. Not your Good job. He has to go work. <laughs> He's like, I have a job. And anyway, I want to show you guys our, our hats because they're cruise oh, hats, aren't they? Me. Well, headbands. Yes. So even though they're Mickey ears, you can wear them. You don't have to, you know, they're not like Disney necessarily. You can wear them on any cruise. Well, it just shows off your love, like if you love Disney and cruising. But they you don't, don't have say. To love Disney. Yeah, and they don't say Disney Cruise Line, so you can wear them on any cruise. See mine? Uh, we got them on Etsy. We went shopping for cruise ears specifically because we wanted to have cruise ears. Mine came from uh, the store called Floofy Arts. Like F L O O F Y A R T S, and they're awesome, aren't they? 
Lizzie has a pair just like it, but with a different color rose in the middle. Floofy Arts, and hers came from Wishery Ears. Wishery. And we're gonna put the link below, because they're really fun to have. Oh, look yeah, how pretty it, it is. It just makes it even more fun, doesn't it? It does. Look at this. This is beautiful. Look at that big glassing over there. That's Serious? So tossed, <laughs> it? Oh, look at the walkway. This is very nice. Look how nice. Very nice. This is so exciting. What is that? So a big ogre in here that sneezed? Ew, what it looks like. There's something on there, obviously. Light? Like a sign. See, and then the oh, and is that oh. Mm -hmm. Aww, You're nice. so smart. I guess it's better than an ogre. Thrilling. This is a Comic Con cruise. Fantasy. Yeah. It's an ogre. So there's going to be a lot of ogres on there. <laughs> Sneezing everywhere. I'm cosplaying as an ogre. <laughs> For safety, I like to use cross. Oh, there's crosswalk. <laughs> I like looking everywhere. Trevon fan here, like. looking at your feet. <laughs> We're walking across the way to the big old ship for the next four days. It's so exciting. Yes. Here we go. I miss Menorah already. I know. I know. It's so sad. This is the prettiest cruise port I've been to. It is. Look at the trolley tracks. I see people walking by, going by in the cars, like pointing and stuff. And I would be like, look, they're going on a cruise. I'm look, go. Port Tampa Bay. Isn't that pretty? I know. This is so nice. So, so this is very different than what I'm used to. And uh, there's like big gap, like raise things in the sidewalk you have to kind of pull your luggage over. You could do the ballet parking for $80. How much? $80. Oh. Or you could do drop off if you guys want. Oh, there's the aquarium. Oh yeah, that big pretty building with all the glass like dome, that was, that's the aquarium. Alrighty, turn our luggage in. This is so exciting. It's funny, Trevon told me just a couple of months ago that he needs to do a cruise like maybe every year, year and a half. Here it's been like what two months? <laughs> and you get the, yep. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Here, second floor, Thanks. Okay, Thanks. make sure you get all your identification, all your documents. Out, okay, please. got it. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Yeah, wouldn't it be terrible if you put them in? Thanks, you too. If you put your uh, documents in your regular suitcase and then they got in there and then you couldn't get on the ship. Yeah. Going to the second floor. I think of your little joke thing about this, Trevon. Uh -huh. What was that little thing you said about going up the escalator and rolling? Falling down an up escalator and subsequently falling for an hour and a half. <laughs> of course, we had to have that explained to us. So complicated. I know. It's 11.53. We're going in the line to go in the terminal, which you guys know we can't record in there. Or if you don't, you should know. <laughs> get him out, get him out. I got it ready. Okay, you guys, we just walked through everything. I mean, it didn't take, there was no waiting. I was like, the guy's like, 20 minutes. walk down this wa walkway, this way to the love boat to get lucky shit. I'm like, okay. Look at our card. It has the fantasy Comic Con cruise made onto it. And then we got our uh, paper and we're gonna get a schedule, I guess. But they said there's gonna be uh, free sail away drinks at the sail away party, which is cool. And the food okay. is open now. And some lady asked me who I was. Oh, because like cosplay? Like, cosplaying as. I'm like, no one? A Disney fan, no. <laughs> <A cruise> fan? <laughs> Boom. Boom. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> oh, I love this wall. Yep, yeah, it's the best walking up it is as as walking down it when you're done. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Okay, we are on. I mean, we're on the ship, but we're about to go in. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Ooh. Oh, we're on. It's so exciting. Yeah, this is so different. Look, they just have these little shops right here. Come on. Besides the mega ship Oasis you've been on, this is, he's just been on the Majesty? Is that it? So this is a big difference for him. So uh, Travon has been on two roller coaster ships so far, which is the smallest one and the biggest one. And this is totally different. Look, there's a coffee bar. We bought a coffee package. I don't know how you get that. Huh. Let's just go up. Okay, first I gotta peek here. Look, they put the thing on the floor. Oh, that's so cool. This is so cool. Wow, that's pretty. This is so different from the other Royal Caribbeans I've been on. Wow. What do you think? You look sad. 
<laughs> okay, it's let's like, go. I know you're not sad. If you see your face, you're just like. I feel like I see what people do when they get on. Like, where do they go? Sit around, just relax, so knowing they're on a ship. <laughs> Stuff, yeah, a lot of people like travel a long time to get here. Maybe they're just darn tired. <gasps> That's a pretty elevator door. Wow. This is the elevator area. Yeah. Is here too? Someone had said that the only thing they didn't like with the ship was the crowded elevator. So let's see how that goes this week, you guys. Although it's not a real normal cruise wise because it's chartered, so it's probably not going to be near as full. Near as full. I wonder what capacity it's selling at. We're going to try to find out. Oh yeah, the elevators are small. <laughs> so we noticed the elevators are facing the side of the ship so you can see outside. Oh, Instead of cool. in the lobby, they're usually across from each other. Does that make sense? I mean, like right here all together, isn't it? Yeah, this is very nice. It's very nautical. <sighs> okay, just so you guys know, they are doing special things for this cruise. So what you see in this video might not be the exact same. Oh, look how pretty. Yes, giant marshmallow. It's so pretty. Sorry, I like the way it's laid out here. I do too. Not only is it pretty and just feels good, but I love the multiple stations so you yeah. can get to everything. I love the nautical design with all the wood and the navy blue and the ships. Okay, we'll follow you, Trevon. Oh. Go ahead. Oh, a table first or food first? Oh, you go ahead. You go ahead. I'll go ahead. I'm going this way. <laughs> what size better to look at? Town or <laughs> Bay. Or I guess it's not bay, is it? 